How's it going guys, Colgan here. So I'm going to show you how to make every upgrade in the in-game shop in Royal Defense Ancient Menace cost zero gems to purchase as having to replay through the same levels hundreds, possibly thousands of times just to get the gems to be able to afford the upgrades to survive on harder difficulties is just not fun at all. So it's very simple what you need to do. You need to find your Royal Defense Ancient Menace icon on your desktop you're going to right click on the icon and you're going to open file location. That's going to open up the games folder. Now in this folder, you're going to find a folder called TD. You're going to open up the TD folder. Now you're going to scroll to the bottom of the TD folder and at the bottom, you're going to find an XML document file called upgrades. You're going to right click on the upgrades file and you're going to open with notepad. Now you're going to maximize the notepad file here. Now, you may not understand anything in this notepad file. Don't worry about it. It's very, very simple what we need to do. We just need to change a few numbers. So you're going to look around here. I'm going to highlight this area here. Step cost G equals zero, cost R equals four. Now, what this line of text means is that it costs four gems to purchase the first upgrade. Now, below that, you're going to find another line of text that says, step cost g equals zero cost r equals 10. now what this line of text means is that it costs 10 gems to purchase the second upgrade and below that you're going to find step cost g equals zero cost r equals 14 14 gems for the third upgrade below that step cost g equals zero cost r equals 18 18 gems for the fourth upgrade and below that step cost g equals zero cost r equals 24 that means 24 gems for the last upgrade so all you have to do in this file everywhere it says cost r equals four cost r equals 10 cost r equals 14 cost r equals 18 and cost r equals 24 you're going to change those numbers into a zero so we're going to change cost r equals four into a zero we're going to change the 10 into a zero. We're going to change 14 into a zero, change 18 into a zero, and change 24 into a zero. Now this area I've edited here, this only represents the damage upgrade for the dart tower, as you can see here. So what you have to do is, you're now going to have to scroll through this entire notepad file, and everywhere you see step cost G equals zero, cost R equals four, 10, 14, 18, and 24. You're going to change 4, 10, 14, 18, and 24. You're going to change them into zeros. It's going to take you maybe three minutes to scroll through the entire notepad file and change all of those numbers into a zero. Once you have that done, you're going to click file and save as. You're going to save it to your desktop. Now you're going to close the notepad file now on your desktop, you're going to see the upgrades file. You're going to drag the upgrades file from your desktop into the TD folder. It's going to ask you to move and replace. You're going to click move and replace and you're going to click continue. Now, all of the upgrades in game are going to cost zero gems. But before we go into game, if you have your Big Fish Games client open, please close your Big Fish Games client. If you have the Big Fish Games client open, if you have that client open when you try to play a game after you've edited the game's files, the game will crash. So if you close the Big Fish Games client, the game will not crash. You do not need it open to run the game. So now that we're in the game, we're going to click shop. I'm going to skip the tutorial. And as you can see here, the damage upgrades for the Dark Tower are cost zero gems. So we're going to upgrade all of the damage upgrades. As you see there, all five damage upgrades for the Dark Tower cost zero gems. So like I said, just scroll through the upgrades file and change anywhere it says cost R equals 4, 10, 14, 18 and 24. Just change those numbers into a zero and every single upgrade in the game will cost zero gems to upgrade. I hope this video helped you and thanks for watching.